Welcome. Today is a new episode of my series along the Yamanota Line in Tokyo, Nishinipuri Station. Nishinipuri Station is in the Arakawa Ward and the Arakawa Ward has many attractions. But I will focus today on the Nishinipuri uh, area. The Yamanote line is going in a circle through Tokyo and it's actually the easiest transportation to remember uh, which connects all major, I don't want to say all, but major tourist attraction in Tokyo, for example Shinjuku or Shibuya. Nishi Nippuri station is actually an extension of Nippuri station and at the Nippuri station is much more attraction is around there, but this is in my next episode. Close to the station there is a small little park with an overview of Tokyo. This park is very old. And the painter Hasegawa Setan, who lived during the Edo, Edo period, draw seven pictures of this area, which are showcased in the park. And the description is all in Japanese, but um, Google Translate can translate you all this, so it's very informative. For a long time you could see Fuji Diamond from this part of Tokyo. This was I think on the 30th of January if I'm correct and 11th of October, two times in a year. But now you can't see this anymore because of the high-rise building in Tokyo or that's what they're saying. So <laughs> I'm not so sure about it. There is a small shrine, the Zuva Shrine, and it has a festival end of August each year. So then you will find a lot of little stalls around the station. So if you are coming end of August to Tokyo, this might be an interesting thing to visit. Everything else? Mm, maybe not. I think the nearby station is much more interesting, Nippori. So yes, so that's it for today. I hope this video was of any interest of yours and I see you in my next video. Thank you for watching. See you then. Bye.